Peter. I guess the game started. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Openly Beta. Today I'm playing Indecision. Uh, I wasn't even sure if, if this was if that was the beginning of the game, but I guess it is. I get to create my own character. What do I want to look like? Or what, uh, what looks like curly hair? Let's go for this guy. Um, sure. Pale as can be, some nice ginger hair, and some nice blue eyes. Is there a red shirt? I'm gonna spend way too long looking for this. That looks good, let's go for it. English. First, so I have no idea what this game is. I've just I've just loaded this up completely blind. Okay, I'm playing this guy. I assumed I'd be playing the little guy I made on the right over there. Home. This is very interesting already. Ooh. Achievement unlocked first. I have no idea what's happening, but I already like it. Right, let's see if I can knock everything off the walls. Let's see if that gets me achievements. Oh, it doesn't look like it. Okay, so it said right. Yeah, okay, so I have to go right. What happens if I walk off this way? Do I go over there? No. Skinner. Skinner? It's weird that I, uh... It's weird that I made that character and then he just stood there and I didn't play as him. Right, I stand on this button I guess. He gave me poo. I don't know how I feel about that. If I press it again, do I get more poo? The poo count is going up. I now have free poo. to move the poo before I can get more. Yeah, it seems that way. Five? That went up by two, didn't it? Oh, man, I'm like a bird person. I have no idea what's happening. Shake. She's like opaque. She's going invisible. Do I want that to happen? Oh man, she's gone. Was that me? I just jump off. I'm getting a lot of achievements at least. Oh jeez, I'm in space. I can't tell if I'm controlling him or not. I think I am. I think he goes like the opposite way to what I do. I really can't tell. <laughs> Let's just hold down, yeah, I feel like, cause I'm holding down right now. And if I hold down left. But I don't know if he's just orbiting. If I don't press anything, he seems to keep doing it. Hmm. See if I can make him fly off. Spring. OK, 
Okay, so when she blinks, the shadow goes in front of me. Oh. This is creepy. I have no idea what's happening. There's got to be some sort of story behind this. Something I'm not getting. But... Either way, I'm enjoying the imagery. Resign. <laughs> Do I have to click there? No, I can just... Oh man! That's really cool. I like that a lot. Cohen? Cohen? Jeez. <laughs> oh, I feel like that was the wrong choice. I wonder if the, uh, the things I do affect the game much. Wait, can I stay up here? Will the shark eat me? I felt this is a good thing to do because the shark's going to destroy the raft. Oh, this is trippy. Just reminds me of those little bit planet levels when you could have like the... I don't even know what you call this. Like the neon outlines. Oh no, I'm stuck. Hmm, maybe there's another way to go. I've like, I mean, this game is completely, I'm losing all words. Just go in there. Oof. Guess I can make that jump. Obey. So that's saying go right. So I'm going to go left. I can't go left. <laughs> so I guess the secret is to not do anything for a while. Hmm, I can't go through there anymore. Low. <laughs> I don't think that was right. Oh, I don't think that was right either. Fool. This is going on for a horrifyingly long time. Oh my god, it's like... That's so weird. This is so weird and trippy. Oh, there we go. Now I'm down right at the bottom. It's so weird, just like walking along my screen. Cave. Oh. Man. Every part of this game is so weird. It's very, uh, very creative though. Can't say I've played much like this. And this is another one of those games where I have no idea where it came from. It just kind of appeared on my Steam. Pretty sure it was again in a humble bundle. Or some sort of sale. You are? What? <laughs> you are, I'll just edit you out. <laughs> This is weird. Oh, I 
not even gonna like that. Oh man. Oh wait, I did it. And now I'm gonna follow him in. Stop. Maybe I shouldn't press anything. I immediately press something. Oh. Maybe you've got to stop in front of each spike, except that last one doesn't work. Ugh, I keep trying like think outside the box. Made it. Didn't die. I really want to replay this and see if different outcomes lead to different levels. Oh, my poo button won't work. There's a fly. Ooh. Oh, it's called fly. Disappear. This is like where Squidward goes on SpongeBob when he goes away in the future. Ooh, that's cool. I went back and got her. There we go. I feel like a lot of this weird imagery can kind of, you can kind of grasp meaning from each individual one in some way. It's very fascinating either way. I wonder how long I have to run for to disappear. Oh, I see. So it's like she ran all the way to the right and her shadow left her. And the shadow runs all the way to the left and then she's gone. And if I go back that way, the shadow will be gone too. And then there was nothing. Limbo. Now this is just the game Limbo. <laughs> I'm I guess this could be uh, classed as a cool homage. Oh man, how do I reach these high up ones? Oh, I couldn't. Roll. Can't roll very high up, so let's see how far down I can go. Hmm, can't even go down. go back and forward. Man, I'm starting to feel like Sisyphus, forever rolling this boulder up the hill. I don't know what I'm being punished for, but it's working. Maybe I don't roll. Maybe that's the secret. Maybe on any level, if you just wait long enough, it'll move on. Maybe that's always like the choice you can make is not to do anything. Never mind. I seem to be getting higher up. I think everything I said was untrue. How did I do that? How did I get higher? I feel like I'm edging up. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Oh. Oh man, I'm so close. I think I have to like press up to reset my starting position. Owl. Hmm. Escape. Is the room gonna flood or something? Hmm, can't do much in the way of escaping. I 
I can run back and forward aimlessly. Maybe that's what this one's about. Maybe I should try and denote meaning from each one immediately. So this one's about how uh, you can never escape from the torment of life. And you can never escape the rain, even from inside. Oh shucks. Don't know what to do here. Okay, so I've been on this on this one for a little while. And I promise I didn't Google it. But I feel like I'm supposed to press the escape key. And go back. I think that worked. That's the uh the thumbnail of the game, so it seems like that's that's quite a relevant one. Well this is weird. Is this I don't like this. Is this a like a reference to Celeste? This is very reminiscent of the uh, hotel in Celeste. Maybe I'm just too obsessed with that game for my own good. Alright, where does this end? So it's about halfway across. So... Didn't make it, which is very annoying. Edge. Oh, can I just leave? I feel like if I walk over there, she's going to go. Oh no, I, can I go? What a bitch, she pushed me. Oh, I became her. Oh, well there you go. I don't know if that was right, but it's what I did. Bait. I don't like that. Am I under the ocean? coin is definitely the bait. It's trying to lure me in. I'm not going to have that. I'm going to escape. Maybe not. I think I just came back to the start of the level. Oh, it felt promising. Fine. I'll buy it. end of the game okay so I can jump other than that I'm stuck running forward oh jeez it's all going thank you for your time I think I just accidentally played through the whole thing. And I feel like knowing this game as well as I do, this is going to be it now. I'm just going to be stuck on this screen. Well, there you go. I pressed escape and the game just closed. Didn't even take me to a pause menu. Well, that was definitely one of the weirdest games I've played in a while. It was very, uh, very different. Um, I'm not sure if you can even call it a game. It was just, just a weird little experience. I'm sure if I go again and do different things, choose different options, there'll be different outcomes, maybe different levels. So that could be something worth checking out. Um, maybe if you want to pick up Indecision, that could be a that could be a little treat for you. It's on Steam, I believe. I think, I, I, like I said, I can't quite remember where it came from. Maybe it's some sort of demon game that just appeared uh, one day. Yeah, so it, it's currently available on Steam for £1.69. I mean, you know, it is what it is. One pound sixty nine isn't anything. I feel like I got I got one pound sixty nine pence worth of enjoyments out of that. Uh, it's a very interesting one, and I feel like I might even go back and see if I can change anything, see if I can get more achievements. So yeah, indecision might be worth might be worth checking out. See you next time.